Right. <laughs> I think you can see the problem here. Yeah, because it's a fixed pipe, isn't it? Yeah. That pipe is too low to use a wastemaster. I mean, probably any other form of, of drain. You'd end up with it up in the air like that. Oh, yeah, and then it's... Where are we now? Wednesday? Uh, no. Um. So you, you don't even know now, do you? <laughs> God. It's Monday, isn't it? Cause it oh, is. it's Monday. Yeah, because yeah, yesterday was Sunday, so yeah. it's Monday. It's Monday. Yeah. yeah, it's easy to lose track of time when you're on a tour, isn't it? Yeah. That's why I have a big clock in the bedroom normally. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> We've lo you're lost without that. Lost without my clock. Yeah. We're, 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 we're planning a big review at the end of this tour, and we were just making some notes last night, and it only really occurred to me when we're talking about uh, the utilities, uh, the water and that sort of thing, that this fan hasn't got an external pump to pump the water in. Mm. I mean, it might not be a problem for some people. If you're moving on, uh, like we're doing at the moment, sort of every two days. We haven't, it hasn't been a, an issue. And it's not there? been an issue because no. the tanks are plenty big, yeah. both, both the waste and the fresh water, about 90, 90 litres. So there's not a problem with having enough water for about three four days I think almost and we've been on a service pitch haven't we yeah so that's helped because we yeah. had our own tap yeah. so we don't have to move the van then no, I just sort of started thinking I mean when we go to some of the shows we tend to use the van like a caravan don't yeah. we because we take yeah. the car and therefore we don't, don't move the van for perhaps a, a week six six it, days seven days seven yeah. days yeah yeah and what we've been what we've used is an aqua roll and an aqua waste, waste. yeah and then we suddenly realised, well, we couldn't use the aqua roll, roll yeah. because we haven't got an external pump. No. And then we thought, could we use the aqua waste to yeah. empty? Yeah. So we borrowed our uh, bottle well, of this all earlier. Is this going to be before we start talking then? Yeah. No, this is going to be... Sorry. <laughs> the, 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 the bit of film that you've made of using their aqua roll, is that going to be before we're talking or afterwards? I try not to confuse people with temporal problems. <laughs> well, anyway, whatever time this the bit of film is, yeah. either you've seen yeah. it or you're about to see it, that is the problem that you yeah. can't empty. You can't too empty low. into an aqua roll because it's too, too low. And I remember when we had the Bailey Compact that we have the same issue. There's not many waste uh, carriers that are low enough to take this this waste pipe. If this fan was mine, I'd make a couple of modifications. I'd do away with the fixed pipe, I'd have a flexible pipe, and I'd have a little uh, 12 volt plug fitted to the outside of the van so I could use an external pump. Yeah. It's not a biggie. No, it, it no. just It just sort of occurred to us really last night. Yeah, that we'd have to, yeah. we'd have to move well, I mean, that's not the end no. of the world, is it? We'd, no, no. We'd have to so it sort, it sort of depends, up. you know, how how you use the van. Mm. I mean, lots of people use Baileys that don't have external pumps, so you know they must they must survive with, without yeah. it. So yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Just wanted to sort of say that, just get it off my mind. That's basically so. It. That's really why we didn't bring the aqua roll, really. Well, no, it? it's not. <laughs> 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 we didn't we didn't bring the aqua roll and the, the waste mass because we didn't think we'd need to use it. No, <laughs> <laughs> but we couldn't have done. We're going to use them if we brought them. That's so. right. Ah. So you're following all this, Pops. <laughs> yeah. So where are you going today, Poppy? Yeah, Poppy. Where are you off to today? Strathclyde Country Park. Yeah, all you right. are, aren't you? All right. We made. A, we also made a little change to our plans as well. We're not going to go to Coniston Park Coppice now. We're going to go d direct from Glasgow to Bury. Birds Country Park. Back to Birds Country Park. We won't film a lot about Birds Country Park whilst we're there because we're going to be busy sort of getting this review together yeah and also on the Thursday we're going to go to the Manchester caravan and motorhome show yeah yeah so we thought we'd have a little look in there it's the first show of the year I didn't really want to miss it no no yeah so it's about, about half an hour away there isn't it yeah. traffic permitting yeah and there's plenty of parking for motorhomes there yeah, so we'll take we took the van last year didn't we yeah yeah, yeah. so that's good all good yeah. so we'll catch up with you later
so much better here, isn't it? Yeah. arriving early. No. Because <laughs> one sat in the car park outside Strathclyde waiting to get in and when we booked in at 12 o'clock the lady said why don't you ring if you're arriving early? So you... So I rang and she said oh no arrivals are 12 o'clock. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we're going to go and park at the end. So we're going, we're going to find a car park in Strathclyde and kill a little bit of time stretch your legs couldn't you? This incidentally, if you've never been to Strathclyde, um, this is the Alona isn't it here? Yes. The Alona Hotel. Yeah, we do really nice lunches don't they? Yeah. Yeah. And, and just coming up here is, what's it called? M&D's? Yeah, there was a sign it's M &D's. It's a theme park. Theme park. Theme park and uh, I suppose it's great for the kids, isn't it? So, was, one, was it closed for ages? They had a problem with I one think, of the rides. I think it was, yeah. yeah. There you go. Middle of winter now. Middle of winter, obviously closed. Don't be there. But yeah, plenty to do for the kids. And on the right hand side it's is the big lock. It's the big lock. Strathclyde Lock. Well, they actually had the Commonwealth Games rowing, didn't they? Yes, right, yeah. There's the bigger car park further round, isn't there? Yeah. Yeah, I don't think you'll get round there. Can I go in here? Yeah, Roman Fort car park. Yeah, I can't see. The light there. Alright. We've got to do ourselves. Yeah. just parked up at the Roman Fort car park so I yeah, guess we'll go and have a walk at the Roman Fort. Fan is absolutely <laughs> filthy. Just saying how dirty it is. Oh, no, might, try and, it? might try and give it a clear. Trouble is I've got a step ladder with me. I don't think I have. Poppy's happy to be out anyway. Yeah, yeah. The pals. Yeah. She's still full of beans. Right, so this is Roman military bathhouse, Bothell Hay. Is it Bothell Hay? Bothell Hay. Yeah. No doubt Bob and Alien will correct us if I'm wrong again. There, there you go. Bobby thinks there's a lot of Roman smells here. <laughs> Right, which is the uh, original wall, wasn't it? Well, it's the furthest the Romans got, isn't Yeah, it? that's right. Got a 500, 500 strong garrison here, originally. Oh, so this is the bathhouse, basically, here? Yeah, it yeah. is, yeah. yeah. What did they call it, a Roman fort, then? Because there was obviously a... There was a fort here, then. Oh yeah, yeah. There's a bathhouse. Oh yeah. So behind, and behind trees that was and up the fort. On the hill was a fort. It's under the water now, isn't it? I guess. Well, the lock's there. Yeah, it's under the water. There's trees. Yeah, I think the fort would have been somewhere up here, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 
I don't suppose there would have been a lock there in Roman times. Right, that was very enjoyable. A little uh, trip down to the fort and a little snooze as well. Can't beat a good snooze. <laughs> reception here. Warnings of snow and ice. just a quick video tonight um, we've we've been to Bob and Aliens and they've fed and watered us very kindly um, taking care of us for the for the day so we're at Strathclyde Country Park tomorrow we're going to take the van out we're going to take Bob and Aileen out in the van so they're going to come along as passengers so we get to try the travel seats out and see how they get on with that uh, we're going to where we're we going Riverside Museum. the Riverside Museum uh, and possibly the tall ships alongside there in Glasgow so that should be good yeah. so looking forward to that so give us a thumbs up remember to subscribe and we'll catch up with you tomorrow yeah.